So this is the Fluke uh, 435 Power Quality Analyzer. Um, it needs a new battery. Very easy. We have the battery out already. Here's the Fluke uh, BP190, which is a 3800 uh, 3, mAh 7.2 volt battery. Have it out already. I just show how it goes back together. We turn over the back. Here we have the housing uh, for the battery with the uh, plug here. Here we plug it in. Battery sits quite comfortably inside here. This is the battery comfortably inside, sitting inside, plugged back in the case. Uh, simply goes on top. Not remember, not forgetting to place the handle uh, back in the sides here. With the handle comfortably in place and the front pushed down so that these clips are together. The housing is already quite secure. So we have two screws here. You can take a normal screwdriver and secure the frame at the front. Or the bottom rather. This is the bottom. So now we can put the, the end caps on, held by two screws. So just a little push fit. And then you just lightly screw together. So with the top on, you can turn it over and put the bottom end on, which again, the screws are here, and just push it into place. Nice firm push both sides, and then we just put those screws in. can be that there's a problem with these screws. See here that the, um, the nut, the thread has gone. And this one is also very uh, here on the limit. Just something to watch out for. Um, I think it's a, probably a design fault that the, the nut there, the square nut, is very thin and there's also in, in, a, in a slot to repair it easily, the thread can be ruined. And here we have it. So we have the, the screws back in, in the bottom. The meter is one unit again. With the top sides. Yeah, that's the Fluke Power Quality Analyzer uh, Battery Replacement in reverse order.